Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna. If you're new here, I do makeup reviews, makeup tutorials, skincare, anything beauty related. I get you covered. Um, if you are new here as well, my whole approach to makeup is always like skin focused. Not meaning that I'm, uh, I stress too much on like skincare. It's more makeup where I want you to look like yourself and I want you to like the way you look too. You know what I mean? Like not really cover up and or or change your face that much. I just want to say that because I've gotten a lot of new followers recently. <clears throat> Excuse me. And um, I know my channel is a little bit different. I focus more on like blush and highlight and like skin and everything and just kind of like looking like you but better or you more comfortable, more confident. I just wanted to say that. Okay, back to the video. <laughs> Today's video, I am going to be talking about the Revolution Beauty Makeup Revolution, sorry, um, Super Dewy Blush. Funny story, I actually filmed a video already, um, and I was talking about this color. It's called Blush Me Up. I liked it a lot. I put it in another order, so I think I'm just going to scrap that video, and we're going to do this one, because then I ordered another shade. These are the new cream or liquid blushes from Makeup Revolution. Now, Makeup Revolution is a brand that is is very inspired by other makeup lines and they come out with products that are like a fraction of the price okay um and i would say for the most part anything that i reviewed with of them so far i have genuinely liked there are a couple of things like in their foundation area or i have a little gripe with them because they don't have anything that's like a yellow undertone it's more like a pink undertone or like a peachy undertone or th the middle shade range, like my shade range is not, um, is ignored a little bit, but that's for another video. But their colored products are pretty amazing. Like their highlighters, their blushes. Um, yeah. Today we're talking about blushes. Getting too off topic. Timestamps will be down below. I have two shades here, as I mentioned before. One is called Blush Me Up, and the other one is called You Got Me Blushing. So, let me quickly read you what it says. It says a buildable gel cream pigment that dabs onto skin to create a healthy, radiant flush of color applied to the apples of the cheeks and softly down the bridge of the nose to achieve an overall natural sun-kissed look. I haven't done, I've done that a couple of times where I put blush like here, but I don't know if we're going to do that today. So we have two different color blushes, one on one side, the other on the other side, like we always do. And then if it looks too crazy, I usually mix them to kind of even them out. But you want to see swatches? Let's do swatches. All right. And here we have the Makeup Revolution Super Dewy Blushes. This is their liquid blush. This is Blush Me Up and you got me blushing so i'm going to swatch them on the like palm of my hand this like meaty part right under my thumb so this is blush me up that's like a light layer is the color it's like sinking into like my little creases of my hand so I'm gonna put it back here so you guys could see it too I do not like the way it's swatched on that part of my hand I think this is a little bit better and then this is you got me blushing i'll put it right next to it and i'll swatch it on the inner part of my other hand so see how it, it is a flush like you can see through it i mean you can definitely build up the color a little bit more but that's really beautiful so i'm going to do it on this hand sorry i'm like this is not the hand i usually do it on Super pretty. All right, swatches are 
pretty. I like colors like this for this time of the year because, you know, they're like little pops of pink or like a sun-kissed kind of, um, kind of look. So, all right. For starters, we are going to do Blush Me Up on this side. And like I said, it comes in this nice like squeezy tube. I personally love when blushes or like face products come with this kind of an applicator because you just have a little more control. So I'm going to just squeeze some on the back of my hand. With this, a little bit goes a long way. You can always build up the color, but with cream blushes, you want to take your time with it. So I'm just going to take it. I'm blending it out. I'm going to smile. I'm just going to go back and tap, tap, tap. Now, this is pretty. It's already giving me a really beautiful flush of color. If I pull back, you can see a little bit more. If I'm like all up in your face, you don't really see it as much. So I'm going to take more and add right on top of that. And this builds nice. Like I said, this is not my first time with this product. So I realize it is buildable and it can layer on very nicely. Let's see, it's pretty nice flush of color. It looks like a natural, like I'm blushing. Now I see people apply this with a sponge. You can absolutely do that. Whatever tool you are most comfortable with, definitely use. I prefer working with my fingers. I feel like my fingers will warm the product up nicely. It'll blend it out nicely. I just work with my fingers better. All right, this is the other shade. You have me blushing. This is more of a sort of like a rose, a true rose, soft rose shade. Let me throw my hair back. And I'm gonna apply this one. Did not mean to block you, I do apologize. So you can do tap tap motion or you can kind of blend back with your fingers. It does dry down pretty quick. Um, and like meaning it doesn't stay wet. I don't know that it fully dries down, but you are left with a nice sort of radiant flush. It's gonna add a little bit more. But you can see I'm applying right on top of what I just did. But you can noticeably see this one's more pink and this one's a little more um, like a brownish, reddish color. I actually think that this color goes more natural with my lip tone, like my natural lip color, because my lips do have a little bit of pink in them. Let me add a little bit more to this side, and then we're going to go into natural light, and you can see what's going on. But the wrong color. It layers on really nice and blends out very, very beautifully. Just like that. When I, uh, before we go into natural light, <laughs> when I was looking at the swatches for these, um, one of the girls swatched it and it was like a lot. And I was like, oh my God, that looks like it's going to be like an opaque, super thick blush. But I'm glad I tried it out. It's not, it's not like that. All right, let's go into natural light. All right, so I'm back at the window, and this is the, I think it's Blush Me Up, the deeper of the two. So if I pull back, you can see it gives me a nice, really pretty flush. And then this is You Had Me Blushing, which almost looks like the color that I naturally flush. And then this is them in natural light. So they kind of have like a satin finish it's not a completely matte because there is a slight bit of radiance but those are the colors really pretty all right so you see the colors up close 
they're very nice both are wearable now sometimes i tend to shy away from like pink pinks um but in reality they do like help to brighten up the face so i can see like if i pull away like this side of my face is more bright it's more lifted that's that's kind of what pink does this side is you know it's a little bit warmer but it's still really nice it adds warmth to my face it doesn't brighten it up as much as the pink does but I do like the way it goes with the rest of my face. And actually, now that I'm looking at both, it's so funny. Because I said this, like, the pink here kind of goes with the pink in my lips. But now I'm starting to see that this color kind of goes with my natural lip color, too. So, both both work nicely. Um, yeah. So, let me know if you guys have tried these. I know, I think there's a couple more shades from what was available online when I purchased. It was this, and then it was, like, a melon shade that I... I was not feeling um so i was like no i don't need that one but let me know if you guys have tried these if you're gonna try them um they do remind me of other blushes that i have at least the color and then a couple of other ones that have a similar texture that can be duped so if you want dupes comment down below and let me know thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next one bye